Hi guys, what's up? Dion Slater here. Um, I've got a brilliant vocal tip for you today. I am really excited about this one. Um, straw formation, singing through a straw. Um, the legend that is Dr. Ingo Tietze, um, top, top voice scientist, he discovered a few years back that singing through a straw helps to unpress and release your vocal folds. So if you've got a job that requires speaking all day and you've got a really tired voice at the end of the day um, and you just kind of want to unpress and reset everything and um, this will help you if you've been singing doing a lot of singing and you've got a tired voice again this will help you I've been doing a lot of it myself lately and I've been doing a lot of this with my students and um, and the feeling of kind of freeness in the throat and in the voice afterwards is just absolutely brilliant so I cannot recommend this enough go out and get yourself some bloody straws they're free in like Starbucks and stuff so I'm not going to regurgitate everything that he says because he's got the um, the original video is on YouTube and I've posted a link at the bottom of my video. Also I've posted another link in which he explains um, like the full science behind it. So I highly recommend that you watch both of the videos because you will learn a lot from it and if you're like me and a total geek you will find it incredibly fascinating. So what do you do with it okay so grab yourself a straw make sure that it's a relatively thin straw um again dr tizza will explain in the video why but a thin straw is better pop it in your mouth now make sure that when you're singing through it that no air is coming out of your nose and no air is coming out of the sides of your mouth okay it's all coming through the straw so start with some sirens And again, just do those for a few minutes. You can go a little bit lower and a little bit higher each time. <clears throat> Don't force anything, okay? It should feel nice and free on the voice. And then once you've done some sirens, do some accents. have to really focus that my eyebrows don't do that on everyone yeah um, so again spend a minute or so doing that and then you can start to sing through the straw where, with a song it can be a song that you're working on and um, that you might be struggling with maybe if there's some high notes or some belty notes if you feel that you usually strain try singing the song through a straw and um, for now i'm just gonna do one that we should all know and um, swing low sweet chariot and again make sure that no air is coming out of your nose or through the sides of your mouth Started way too low then. Now, when you're singing your songs through a straw, a lot of people have a tendency to do this, and um, it's because they want to watch the straw. In reality, I mean, you should not be singing your songs like this. So, I want you to adopt the same posture or the proper posture that you should be adopting when you're singing your songs okay so chest out you don't want to be all stiff but again i did a video on this posture and um, so chest out you want to make sure that your neck you're not doing the text neck that the back of your neck is nice and lengthened so just adopt the same posture that you would when you're singing your songs properly and vocalize through the straw that way also watch that you're not just using a lot of glottal which I find a lot of people tend to do because when you're singing the song coming for to carry me home you're not doing glottal on there so why would you go mm, 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 mm. right so sing your songs through see how it feels like I say the feeling of freeness that myself that my students have been feeling after vocalizing through the straw is just absolutely amazing and I am really really noticing such a difference like it just sounds more resonant it is just it's brilliant and there's no strain and um, this is also amazing if like me and um, because I'm quite a hyperactive person as everyone who knows me will say and um, I have a tendency to speak and to sing quite loud and um, and again, that means that at the end of the day, if I've been teaching all day, back to back, um, my voice can be a bit tired. So five to 10 minutes of just vocalizing through this, it honestly, it just helps so, so much. 
highly recommend it make sure that you watch the videos at the bottom here the um, of the links that i posted and get yourself some straws if you know where i live i've just bought a thousand of them <laughs> so gary feel free to come and get some off me and um, but yeah happy singing through a straw and until next time see you later